Hello everybody, Don Tothon here, and welcome to Spime. Now this is a game by David Mills, he's on itch.io, and I'm going to leave a link in the description for all you peeps out there. What is this? Oh, it's a gamepad. Crap, where's my gamepad? Let's just use the keyboard. Alright. I don't even have any clue what this game's about. Yeah, I'm going to go with keyboard right now. I hope this music ain't copyrighted, because it's awesome. What? What's going on? Look at the freaking cobra snake right there, dude. It's got a rattler on it. Sally's Diner. This summer. <clears throat> Arnold Schwarzenegger is Don Tronathon in Sally's Diner. Coming to a theater near you. <laughs> okay what is this game about dude that was a weird dude back at the counter back here this is kind of epic whoa this cat eyed dude guy is that us mm, those were some good pancakes so glad I came out tonight it's getting late though. I'd better make a stop at the restroom real quick before hitting the road. Okay. Where is the restroom? I have to party. Excuse me, waitress. I have to party. Well, crap. Alright. That's the kitchen. <laughs> Let me just go in here and mess up everything. Where is the cooks? And where are the cooking... Nobody's cooking. Alright, what a weird... So there is a sprint. Okay, ooh. Weird immersion here. Restroom. Mail is on the cry on this side. Yeah. I'm a male, correct? Because there are urinals. Oh, what's that you say? That's loud! The president's face is on fire? And you want me to put it out? Well... My country needs me. What the snot? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. What's in here? Should I take a leak? No, I don't guess so. Come on, man. What is this? It wasn't here a minute ago. I guess we'll wash our handles. Some kind of note? I wonder who left it. Yeah, what does it say? I'm not yet sure what has happened. Every time I try to leave this diner, I end up right back inside. I'm leaving this note as proof to myself. Proof that I can't possibly be returning to the same place. It's hard to imagine even writing this. I know how moving around works. One foot in front of the other, same as it's always been. So why the crap am I not going anywhere? I don't know. Hey, continue? Okay. So basically that was probably a note from ourselves to ourselves to let us know that we can go in the women's room. Whoops, wrong room. I don't care. Get out of here before someone sees me. No. No. There's no candy in there. <sighs> hey, what's going on, barkeeper duty? What's your face? Can I interact with you? What the? What was on his eyes? Watch him. What? He's got orange eyes. Hey. <laughs> All right, let's get out of this joint. Let's blow this popsicle stand. What's out this door? Nothing. 
Whoa. It's so weird. It's so, what's outside? I don't know what's out there, but I'm going out there. Hey, see y'all later. Only people in here making so much noise. All right. What's happening? Am I going crazy or something? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Ah! Uh, here's a note to myself from myself again. Another note? Yeah. I what it says. Oh, I'm gonna read it for you. Another jump. No sign of the little bastard. No matter if time is what it takes, then time is what I got. So long as those flying meatballs don't show their ugly heads. Flying meatballs, eh? This game is like the Twilight Zone. What is this picture? Wow, that is so cool in a way. Alright. Oh, he turned into stone! What's wrong with them? It's like looking at a ghost. It's like looking at a stone person. Can't walk through them. Do I go back to the bathroom? I don't like the way you flip your head around. These, these people, I told them to leave earlier. At least they're quiet. Look outside. We're in the desert. We're in the desert. Look at the sky. It's red. It's the same way out there. And the pictures have changed on the wall. Some freaking awesome looking pictures that you don't normally see in games like this. Dude, some of these pictures are like creepy cool, man. They're like interesting. Okay, I go out of this door. Ah, oh, I forgot to go in the toilet. Never mind. I'm back where I started. That's creepy. This summer. I'm going in the women's room. Anybody in here? I'm trying to cheat and look above my head. Alright, nothing in here. Let's run to the men's room and go in where the children are. Did that child just travel in time? Back to the future? Oh, great Scott! What's with all this? Do I go pee again? No. No. Nothing's in here. All right. So weird. Nothing in here again, right? All right. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, getting turned around and flop around. Let me go back out the door I came in. That's strange. It seems to be locked. But I just came through it not two seconds ago. And didn't I just leave out... The back door? Wonder why it got rid of that. Can we turn this on? I want some music. Sky is still red. There's still no kitchen staff. And they're trapped. Oh, there's a note. Let's read it. Okay. Gah! Whoa. Space to interact. Huh? Oh! Did you see that? Oh! Yeah, yeah! Okay, I want to read that though. I am not pushing that button. I want to read the note. There we go. Starting to wonder if I didn't just dream the whole bit. Simon. Flying meatballs. Some kind of way out. I figure there's little good in waiting around here. Nothing going on anyway. Best lead I got is finding old golden boy and seeing just what he has to say. Okay, who's old golden boy? Get out of this. Get out of here. I forgot how to do this. All right. All right, we got that. We got that. Uh-huh. 
I'm leaving. Saw a picture, got distracted. Oh, the pictures have changed. Look at this one, guys. That's so creepy. Weird. Oh, is anything changed? Going in the men's room again. Aha! There's the culprit. Interdimensional travel and you. Hello, and welcome to the exciting world of interdimensional travel. It can be pretty exciting to wander the mysterious landscapes of the multiverse, but it can also be dangerous. Remember to always follow the interdimensional rules and regulations when passing between possibility scapes. To begin the instruction, insert tape now. What was all that? This whole situation keeps getting stranger by the minute. Wonder if I find any more of those things. What things are you talking about? I've not seen any things except for a little child who's running about. Why can't we take endless leaks? The screen mechanism on... Oh, it's in the girls' room now. Anybody in here? No. Just a little toilet papers. Good lord. Alright. Oh my god. Where's the note? I need the note from the notebook. These people didn't even talk to me to begin with. What is that? Was that here earlier? Huh? Ah! Forgot about that mechanism. Huh? Apparently it doesn't really... Alright. I don't see anything amiss here. I'm not paying much attention to it. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? What are you guys doing over here? Let me... Get out of here. <gasps> A note. I wonder if these notes really benefit anyone. I write them, sure, to maintain sanity with the other occupants at this diner no more than what I can honestly refer to as holograms. I have no real social interaction. Between the time it takes running from these horrific meatball monsters, looping the endless diner sphere, as I've dubbed it, and chasing down Golden Boy, or was it Yellow Boy? I wonder just what other application these notes could have. Maybe I am interacting outside my realm of existence. Can you hear me, other me? Can you hear me, future me? Are these the proper terms? I have already, if my theory is correct, doubled up on myself. Is it possible to occupy a present in more ways than at two at a time, three at a time, more? I am running out of paper, so I will leave my thoughts here. It has probably all been for nothing anyway. Okay. Arrest him. That's a tall waitress. Let's get out of here. Wait a minute, is that a Grateful Dead poster? No. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I'm back. Hello, everybody. I'm back. Everybody okay in here? Let me go check this. Not saying anything about that. Let's go in the boys' room. I saw it. I just want to go check the toilet. See if there was a turd in this. What the heck is that thing? I'd better find somewhere to hide fast. I am hiding in here. As a man would. Done hiding. I need to see this, see what it does anyway. Okay. Fundamentals of moving through the multiverse. Imagine an ant crawling across a sheet of paper. We can think of the paper as representing a plane of existence, and the ant is us. Technology has finally progressed to the point where it is now possible to connect different planes of existence, the same way we can connect two or more sheets of paper. Just as the ant moves from page to page, you too can travel from existence to existence. Insert tape for more information. I'm going to call bullcrap on that. 
If that was true, I'd have done already done it. Yes, sir. The check is in the mail. I'm not hiding. I'm a man with lipstick. Maybe I should hide in here with the girls. All right, let's just face our fears head on. That's a meatball, right? That's the meatball thing he was talking about. Wait a minute. It's over there peeing in the floor. I just want to read this note, so screw off. Oh my god! Oh, it found me! Oh! What did it do? Did it eat me? Okay. Maybe it's not there yet. I just want to eat. I mean, I just want to read the note. Oh my god. Alright. I'm definitely still here, wherever here is, and for that matter, whatever I happen to be at this point, what does it even mean to, to be me, or anyone? I just saw myself get, I don't know, eaten by one of those things. The weirdest part was I s saved me just before I, I died, then it disappeared. What an interesting concept into the paranormal should I just get out of here or go check the toilets again I think I was supposed to die boys room seems to be of interest in this game for some reason nope I'm just running full force getting out of here going the way going out does the sky turn a different color I think it has nope it's still red let's get out of here as the pictures keep changing. Where the meatball? It's in here. Aha! I think I've already been in this dimension. Tape C. Avoiding paradoxes. Our actions as interdimensional travelers can echo unforeseen consequences across the farthest reaches of infinity. Therefore, we must tread carefully to avoid setting into motion any event that could alter the course of other planes of existence. Remember, the care and maintenance of other worlds and their inhabitants is everyone's responsibility. Refer to the handbook, The Do's and Do Not Do's of Interdimensional Travel that ship with your device for more information. What device? I have no device. I'm just like this dude running around and all the markings are gone. Going to the girls room, the markings are gone. I'm not checking those toilets anymore. I'm done with it. I'm getting, I'm just going to keep going. I'm looking for notes here and there and that's it. See any over there? No. Here's one more. I thought I'd quit putting notes to myself. So, what can I say about my situation as of now? I suppose, from what I can tell, I'm caught in some kind of paradox. Time and space as I know it has been royally screwed, and it's all thanks to this Simon kid. There's some kind of way out, but as far as straight answers go, this source of mine is a regular riddle wrapped in an enigma. Still, he didn't... He did say something about an old man in a red blanket. It's a better hint than nothing, I guess. An old man in a red blanket. I'm getting out of here. That's a meatball. There you go. <laughs> I knew what to do there. Let me go check the boys' room. Oh my god. It's going to kill me. Oh my god. I have to do something. I need a gun. Go! Oh! There it is. Cape D. Fifth Dimensional Travel 101. As a user of 5D technology, your capabilities for passage stem beyond our fifth dimensional status to lower levels of existence. 
think back to the idea of an ant traveling along a sheet of paper. Okay. Imagine now if the paper were to be rolled up so that both ends are now touching. Like a toilet paper. From one end of the sheet to the next, a loop is created. Inhabitants of this existence are bound to the sheet as their forms are governed by the laws of this dimension. As a fifth dimensional traveler, however, you are free to cross to any point on any plane at any given moment. Like three six Such nine. Items must be tempered with caution, as failure to act within the safety guidelines could disrupt not only the currently occupied possibility space, but rupture adjacent planes of existence as well, causing great rifts to echo across the infinity sphere. Travel with caution. Well, yeah, duh. You don't normally just travel dimensional. Why was this in the girls' room? Let's get eaten by the meatball. Come here, meatball. Actually, I'm just gonna go back. Nope, I'm not. Come get me. How about you? Oh my god, it's so fast. Oh my god, what's wrong with that thing? Did I die? Can I die? Where am I? I'm just running straight through. No, I'm checking the toilets real quick. I feel like I went in time. Just to some other, oh, look where I'm at. I'm in this place again, where I've been caught before. What was that? Okay. No, get out of the bathrooms. Okay, restrooms, whatever you call them. We're leaving. I'm gonna go check the bathrooms again. Nothing, nothing. Girls room. Nothing, okay. There's gonna be a meatball out there. Let's go. Go. You got this. Just run straight through. I don't see a note. Space to hide. So I can hide here. Interesting. So he's here looking for me. Where's he at? What's he doing? Is he trying to eat me? I cannot see anything going on. How am I to know? Let's get eaten. Go! <laughs> okay. Going to the bathrooms real quick. Going to check some things. Oh my god. Nothing, nothing. Alright, ready for this? If it comes... Oh my god, no! Do we have enough... We don't have a chance. Let's go. Hurrah! Am I ever going to win this game? <laughs> Alright, where am I? No notes. Just going straight through. And I will continue to do so. Not checking the bathrooms. There's a note. I have recovered a device that details the monster. These flying meatballs, as I have been referring to as of this point, are also known as quantum keepers, a rose by any other name, it should seem. Regardless what you want to call them, they spell death. Anyway, you slice it. I will continue to avoid these quantum keepers, at least until when or perhaps if a better way reveals itself. If they do come to dissolve to their dark matter state, it if the PLD, whatever the crap it is, unit I have recovered is to be believed upon absorbing a paradox, then perhaps I can come to use this to my advantage. Get out of here! We gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna keep running till I see notes and things like that. Not going in the bathrooms. Nothing. 
Just going straight through. Not for sure how I'm going to win this game. Is this the key? Oh my god. <laughs> ah. <laughs> he don't see me. Why don't he see me? Go in the kitchen. I'm hiding. Go into the kitchen. Do not come over here. You a-hole. I'm dead. Let's go. <gasps> he didn't see me. He didn't see me. <laughs> oh! Lost all progress. A E Enforcement of interdimensional safety laws and regulations. Hmm. In order to maintain balance between planes of existence, special enforcers, commonly referred to as quantum keepers, are dispatched to nullify any paradoxes that may arise. Oh, we done figured this the out, man. The purpose of these creatures is to track down any paradoxical entity that can present itself within a looping time scale. Once any threat is eliminated, they simply fade from existence and convert to dark matter state until the need calls upon them again, repeating the cycle as necessary. Though frightening in appearance, the Quantum Keeper plays a crucial role in protecting against paradoxes that may otherwise spread to surrounding planes of existence and restore order to the multiverse. Okay, so basically I can't win this game, because it is... A paradox of time, time warps, and leaps and bounds. I am the quantum. I am Quantum Leap, which was a good movie show back in the day. I might go, Whoa! Who are you? Get away from me. Are you an a-hole? All right, let's get out of here. That was creepy. Oh, my job. All right, nothing else. To do. Okay, we got to get out of here. I touched myself in the same self in the, in the matter of which I was already. No! I'm getting out of here. Get him. Let me turn around real quick. He's not even looking at the other guy. Oh, crap. I can't get out of here. No! Ah. No! Crap, dude. I almost beat it. I was climbing a... This dude, man. Alright, this is me, right? And we couldn't go out that door. And we can't go out the door that we came. So, I have to go over here. And I'll climb in here. No, it won't let me. And it wouldn't let me go out here. No. So I need to go over here and, and hide. It won't let me. So I have to go to the bathrooms again? Women's first. Nada. Nada. Alright, now we can go hide under the table. I can't do anything. It's over, dude. It's over. I've already touched my... Oh, there's a note. Why won't I let me eat it? I want to eat this note. The quantum keeper is coming. Don't you understand? Why won't it let me get it? Do I need to touch myself again? Did I even touch myself to begin with? That's a thing, right? All right. I went straight through him. All right, I touched him. The quantum keeper is coming. I don't understand. I don't understand. I can't leave. I can't do any things. Get the quantum thing. Yeah, what you do? Yeah, let's get it. 
Oh, I didn't know we could do this. Yeah, I did. Look out. Man on the move. Man on the run. Only one of me jump. Hey, here's a note. I can't even read this note. Is this a note to myself? From myself? This just may be the end. This just may be the end of the game. To where I just roam around in my own existence and filth. I can't do crap. This may be it, fellas. This may be the game. This might be the end. I'm going to call it the end because I can't do nothing. So, my time is up anyway. So, if you like this game, smash like and subscribe. Um, if you want to play it yourself, there will be a link in the description below. And uh, if you want to support this channel... There's also a link in the description below. Redcon One Products. If you want to help and support this channel, go ahead, like, and subscribe, like it always. And, uh, you know, link in the description. Until next time, everybody have one of them good ones. Bye.